it. Seriously, fuck you, brother. I'm yeah. not fuck dude. No, they spent, they're all fucking, especially <laughs> back then, roided yeah. out, lifting every day, drinking every day, fighting every day. Oh. Yeah. They were for like five straight years. They hated Was it Jake the Snake or was it the Undertaker that had the broken eye sockets? <laughs> was it the Undertaker? Weren't there it like five under He had a special mask he had to wear for a while. He, he shattered his fucking eye socket in the middle of a match. This Mexican dude landed on his face. His move, instead of fucking your face, he'd drop his butt on your face. Oh. So he drops his butt on... Who was it? It was like a famous um, guy. Yep. Mysterio? No. No? Giant guy. Uh... Dude, that's this crazy. dude landed his butt on his face oh, and no. broke his eye yeah. socket. And so he's like, ah! And he's got to finish the match. He's got to finish this match with Undertaker. a Undertaker. Is that why his eyes started eye going up like this all the time? <laughs> <laughs> that was well, he actually said he ran into a clothesline. I'm reading a quote from him. Oh, he ran into a clothesline. It was that guy, Mabel. Mm, okay. I thought mm. I thought the guy landed on his face. Didn't you he think says so? He's, he's like, he was six foot eight, 500 pounds. I ran straight into what was supposed to be a clothesline, but he was so gassed, and I ended up hitting a spot in his arm. Oh. Oh. Actually, Jamie, arm. I think he broke his eye socket twice. I think, if I remember correctly, he broke both. Broke both eye sockets. Well, this is him. Jesus. This, according to this, it says this is what he said on the Joe Rogan experience. Oh. So. Yeah, the, both eye lost, sockets. Yeah. 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 See, but. that's right. One was because the guy was completely out of shape. A lot of similarities. The other one, I think, was the the butt to the face. Oh. I think he's saying he broke both because we showed another one that he did where the guy wasn't as big who landed on his face. I, I might be remembering this wrong. I've, I have a very limited memory for pro wrestling. <laughs> yeah, I watched. I go, yeah, that's great. They threw the grandma through the table. That's threw it. the grandma yeah. through the table was pretty uh, awesome. I'll delete that by the end of the week. <laughs> by the end of the week, no, I'll you'll have never no knowledge that, never that, that happened. Dude. You'll never you'll have that. dreams about no, dude, it, dude. I remember. You're right. You're right. Rey Mysterio did hit him, and that cost him. Damage. There you go. Yeah. Okay. So it was Mysterio, and oh, he, he landed hit him with the hurricane I think Rana. He landed with his butt on his face. See if well, you can Mysterio is super small. That's not the butt face. He got hit in the face by him. I think. But Rey Mysterio would be hopping you around. You said like he's that. super small. Yeah, that's yeah, bony, that's, bony he, I butt. think he landed on his face. Oh, dude! I think that's the th that's the reason why he got him that way because he landed um, with his butt on his face. The dead man. <sighs> the dead man. <laughs> dude, that's so dude. gross. <laughs> landed on Undertaker's head. He mistimed a top rope senton. Imagine and landed on that. the Undertaker's head. Yeah, ah. he landed on his head with his butt. Ah. Yeah, he mistimed the move and landed on his face and broke his face. Dude, imagine looking forward to that all day. That guy's going to put a like, jump on your face with his ass. <laughs> you know that's coming. You're like, fuck, dude. Oh, but the fuck. other guy fucking your face. Yeah. <laughs> fucking your face. And you have to like lay there like you're out cold. You have to, in oh. front of an arena. And this dude you just get... bang, 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 and then suck it right in front of you. That's your job. Yeah. Remember the wrestlers that never won? There'd be like Kevin. Yes. Kevin would come out and just get smashed <laughs> yeah. every time. Like, That's what I mean. <laughs> that dude has to sit there and get his face fucked. The whole crowd's like, you're fucking gay, pussy. <laughs> and then you gotta go back. Everyone's like, the guy who fucked you is awesome. You probably got you like seven in the locker room. They're like, nice work, dude. That's what's so weird don't about look wrestling. At how enthusiastic the divas, people dude. get. Yeah. It's oh, fucking angry. crazy. They it's get crazy. So fucking angry at the bad guy. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> they, they fire him up. Those bad guys will come out and be like, Delaware. What a bunch of fucking retards are you? <laughs> and they're all just like, no. <laughs> well, uh, do you ever watch they'd the Andy Arabs, Kaufman? They'd have Arab dudes come out and be like, America fucking sucks ass. <laughs> and these dudes are like, take that the fuck back. Dude. Wasn't that the Iron Sheet? Yeah, Iron Sheet. They had dudes come out Bro. for everything. There was Russians. They have everybody. Back in the day, like The Rock was part of... Uh, Nation of Domination. They're yeah, like yeah. black African extremists that would come out and be like <laughs> in front of all the white people. They were like, no, no. Did you ever watch the Andy Kaufman films? Yes. When he was doing girls? pro wrestling? That was crazy. Hilarious. The fact that he decided that that yeah. was what he was going to do. <laughs> they are. Bring that down to South Carolina. I think, the, I think the CIA assassinated three of them, actually. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Two of them were FBI informants. Yeah. Jamie, see if you can find some of the Andy Kaufman footage. The Rock Kaufman was a snitch. He <laughs> snitched on Farouk, dude. He told me, like, we make you a movie star. Just yeah. got to give up your brothers. You got to snitch on Farouk. He did it. <laughs> he put a bomb in Farouk's <laughs> house. <laughs> Imagine if it turns out the Rock's working for the FBI the whole time. How could he I mean, not be? 
Yeah, at this point, how could he not be? How do you think they made so many Jumanjis, dude? <laughs> yeah, it's fucking intelligence written all over it, dude. That's Mockingbird, bro. <laughs> Jumanji's Mockingbird. Jumanji was a fun movie, man. How dare you? <laughs> Jumanji's. Dude, wait. Hit the, record. the first one? Hit the yeah, record. I I, hit the record. Dude. Wait, the it. Robin Williams one was incredible. No, I went to see the the Rock one with my kids. I loved it. All right, with kids, maybe, dude. Check I the went, record. I, I praised a, Jumanji. I had a rough <laughs> I praised Jumanji. <laughs> you like you Jumanji. Yeah, you guys it. have kids. It's a good movie. I was in Boston by myself. I was in Boston by myself. I was doing comedy. I had to kill a whole day. I had nowhere to stay. I went to a Panera Bread by myself. I'd never drank coffee before in my life. I was like 30. I never drank coffee. I was chugging cold brews all day. Ooh. I didn't know it would give you a panic attack. I had a... <laughs> and then I went and saw Jumanji by myself at like 2.30 p.m. Oh, my God. And I was in there just like, holy shit, dude, I'm a fucking <laughs> moron. <laughs> I saw Jumanji by myself. I feel bad. And then I called Matt, and I was like, man, I want to quit comedy, dude. I'm so fucking sad. <laughs> <laughs> like, I've, been Pan- I've been in a Panera for four hours I, drinking iced bro, coffee. Ten, in a booth by myself. ten hours. Oh, no. I spent a whole day in a Panera. Oh my I had no God. money, dude. Yeah, That's hilarious. It's zero dollars. Well, I, I saved up 30. to see Jumanji. Yeah, you, you gave recent. me so many fire movie recommends, and finally I came out of Jumanji. I was like, Shane's gonna like this, and he gave him a panic attack. I was like, Fuck, my bad, dude. <laughs> yeah, I, it fucked me up. How crazy! I was, was in it? there by myself watching Jumanji. Just dude, it's like this is for real a low point. This is like a fucked up thing, dude. I used to- <laughs> I'm an adult. It was a weekday, 2 p.m. in Boston. That is a weird thing. And yeah. that, that was before, yeah, that was like, I had this my, could capsize. My whole life could capsize. My life, it was capsized. I was swimming. True, true. I was, dude, <laughs> my ex-girlfriend gave me her old laptop, so I had like a Chromebook that was like a $90 Chromebook. Your laptop was dead. I was by myself. I would find websites that had old games. I was playing like SimCity 98. <laughs> Chugging Cobra. Dude, this is fucked up. Now that I'm saying it. But I was like, oh, there's a movie theater in the parking lot. I'll go see whatever they have. Jumanji at 2 30. Yeah. I'm in. Yeah, those days on the road in the early days, they can be, they're, they feel weird. It was really sad. And also, if you're working with people you don't like, like you, you show up in a town and the middle's a douche.